I'm Luminary with DJ Boombody, here to give thoughts after the trailer. Stay tuned. And there it is, Heroes of Ruin by Square Enix. It says here that Heroes of Ruin challenges players to carve their own adventure, joining forces with other heroes through seamless drop-in, drop-out co-op multiplayer for venturing forth alone. Players will enter an ever-changing world where danger awaits around every corner. Heroes can explore and fight through wild, varied, and dynamic environments, discovering new layouts and routes each time they play. Custom built for the Nintendo 3S... With support for online play and a wealth of social gaming features, players will find a new experience awaits them every day. All right, Boombody, what are your thoughts on this? Uh, well, well, my thoughts, of course, number one, have to go to the graphics. Um, because, well, it, it, is a, it, is, it is a title specifically made for the 3DS. Mm -hmm. and, and to me, it just it looks like it should be on, you know, a, a PS2 or a PSP. Um, it doesn't, uh, it, it has, it, but of course it does pull that, that, that very score Enix feel out of the, out of the graphics in my opinion. Oh, of course. And, um, you know, with, uh, with the drop in, drop out and, and, you know, the, the, it seemed pretty, pretty well fast paced, yeah. um, or of a decent pace. Um, definitely something to expect from squares, all the sparkles from all the attacks and everything else. Mm, <laughs> sparkly attacks of death. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I'm I'm definitely definitely liking it. Um, like I said, hopefully hopefully once the the game comes out and you know of course you know we're looking at it on a on a on a nice on a nice you know twenty something inch screen. It's a little bit different than than the three and a half inch screen or four inch screen mm -hmm. of the DS. So um, a little bit easier to look at look at those uh, look at those flaws. But uh, no, it looks like a great game. I mean the classes look uh, you know well well. Um, uh, well diverse. I mean, it doesn't look just like it, it doesn't. Uh, it, it seems like there's going to be a good bit of variety in it as far as the gameplay. Mm -hmm. um, so we'll, we'll have to definitely something we'll have to keep an eye out for. Yeah, definitely something that's interesting is putting that type of uh, drop in drop out gameplay on a mobile platform, which means anywhere you go that has Wi Fi access, I mean, mm -hmm. you can hop in, play with your buddies, play with people you don't know, and hopefully that feature is toggleable. I can't imagine them putting that in without. It, I would assume it would be. I mean, most most of the games these days. Um, I mean, I know you can. Without getting too off topic, I know like Dungeon Defenders, you can you can have it to where people can join or not join. Oh, yeah. um, and a lot of those, a lot of the multiplayer games now are making it making the toggleable effect. Um, so that's definitely something to be to be uh, to be pretty. It, it should be pretty neat, and hopefully open the way for future games. Mm -hmm. Well, any yeah. final thoughts on this trailer, uh, Boombody? Uh, my my final thought would have to be that uh, I saw Murlocs. Oh yeah, gotta love the Square Enix spin on the Murlocs. I mean, they're they're not quite Murlocs, but they're Murlocs enough. <laughs> like uh, when I saw it, I went Murlocs. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, on that note, Heroes of Ruin will be released early 2012. I'm and I'm. <laughs> And we'll see you next time.